Air hostess Sharp has walked down many an aisle, but none have placed to the man of her dreams. I have some really strange types. I used to fancy Ron Weasley from Harry Potter, the ginger one. <laughs> I don't know, he had sex appeal. Come on, he did. He definitely did. Hi. Good afternoon. Good afternoon. What's your name, please? Sean. Yes, yeah, Sean, you're the first arrived. Please, come to the bar. Thanks. Thank you very much. Hello. Hi. I think I need a gin and tonic. Oh, thank you. I have been hit on by a passenger. There was a husband and a wife and the kids. I was getting some vibes from the husband, I thought. Oh, OK, this is a bit weird. And he kept pestering me and pestering me the whole flight. He gives me his number and a bit of paper. And his wife was sitting there the whole time, watching all of it. If my husband or boyfriend did that to me on a flight, I would have grabbed his hair, dragged him into the toilet and beaten him up. He was coming out. Sean's date is movie buff Nick. His favourite film may be Titanic, but he's hoping he won't sink without a trace. Hey, Jen. Without sounding corny, life is pretty much like a movie. You're the, you're the main star, aren't you? I normally cast myself as like the hero, the lead actor that's kind of a bit of a rogue. Can I ask you to leave your umbrella in the, uh, yeah, of course. In the box there? I'm looking for that big explosive moment where you think, wow, I've just met the person that I'm going to fall in love with. No, no, you see it on films every day. Hi. Hi, sorry you, you made me jump. That's I was right. in my own little world there. How you doing? I'm Nick. Nice to meet you. I'm you Sean. Right? Nice to meet you, Sean. You How right? you doing? Yeah, nervous. You? I feel all right, actually. Yeah? Where are you from? Uh, Epsom. In Surrey. Where are you from? Essex. Are you from Essex? Yeah. You right? I love Essex, boys. <laughs> <laughs> Are you quite a romantic person? Yeah, I'm a girl. If a girl says they don't like write romance, then they're lying. I'm a bit of a romantic gentleman, actually, oh, yeah. so yeah. Are you a gentleman? Yeah, I'd like to think so, yeah. Good. I'll let you be the judge of that at the end Good. of the day. Good. Are we going? Yes, please. Would you like to follow yeah. me? Yeah, thank you. Off to you, Sean. Thank you. My flirting techniques, I would probably just throw out a few compliments. Um, few suggestive comments. Not too suggestive, obviously. I don't want to offend up. I'm just about getting my hips in this one. <laughs> I've got a massive badonkey. you got a nice bum. That's why I let you Did you, you check it? <laughs> Cheeky! No, I was being a gentleman. Yeah, you were. That's why I've done it. <laughs> are they, um, I have to ask, are they... Are yeah, they, they are real. Yeah. Yeah, they are. I have to ask. That's right. Get that out of the way. I'm not really a boob man, but... This is doing friends. it for you. <laughs> How would I get ready for the day? Well, it's probably going to take me about four hours. Oh, and I do blow dry my nun with a hair dryer just before I put my pants on. So it's dry and it won't smell. <laughs> I thought you were older. That's do I not... look older? No, 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 you don't look older. You just come across older. So okay. I thought you were a little bit older. I said, like, 29. 